So a lot of people that would look at a landscape like this would say, oh, it's, it's dead, it's destroyed, you know, it's gone forever. In fact, that's not the case at all. I see a disturbed environment like this as undergoing a natural process of recovery. Our research helps us make better decisions about how to manage these kinds of environments. We're in Buttery National Park and we're conducting long-term monitoring surveys for the fire studies. Um, so today we've been doing mammal trapping and we're looking to see what animals we've got in various um, habitat communities. Today we caught both um, marsupials and non-marsupial mammals, so eutherians. Um, we've had long-nosed bandicoot, which is becoming quite rare. The Buttery National Park is in the south coast of uh, New South Wales. There are 130 permanent monitoring sites in the park that ANU have set up and we've set them up since 2003. So it's really important to return to these sites year after year after year to see how things are changing through time, see differences between a place that's been burnt and a place that hasn't, a place that's been uh, treated for, for weed control and places that haven't. So that the data that we collect are fundamental to making good environmental decisions and that will be important to maintain the fabric of these beautiful places for the next 10, 20, 30, 50, 100 years.